don't you just love it when you try to shoot a video and you do it five or six times and yeah well here goes number seven Alright, today I am back with a request for the Custom Dynamics Pro Glow Bluetooth controller installation. Uh, in my last video, you seen I ran my wire from my headlight through my factory wiring tray, and it is actually plugged into the P1 port. And there is a reason for why I have it there and I will be with that in a second. I'm gonna run over everything else first. Your negative, easy to get to, screw it in. Your positive, you will have to remove this bolt and this bolt. Lift up and forward and you'll be able to get to the positive terminal which you will put your blue and your, your red leads together, put them on, screw them down, put the tray back on, put the two screws back in. This brain box here may pull up, which it'll pop right back down. No big deal. Once you do that, you have full power on your controller, minus one piece. And I do not like cutting into a wiring harness at all for any reason. And I have a feeling it will probably be done here soon to this bike, but that's for another video and you have a wire that is your brake input on here it's called bb on the controller so i didn't want to splice into the factory harness so what i have i have the triple play right here i have my sequential lights on my bags plugged in from the input the sequentials and then the triple play right here the red wire in the corner here is your brake light so just put you a connection in there, crimp it down, and then you have the capability for the next part, which is the ProGlow app. Once you get on the ProGlow app, you hit the corner here, you hit the corner, you hit the settings button, go to brake sync. You have brake signal sync, and you have that would be on channel one override if you have that off then your headlight will operate as a brake light so if you have purple for instance on your x headlight you hit the brakes it'll go to red which you have to look your you have to look at your state laws to see what's legal in your state i don't know i don't i have it turned off uh the channel two and three will be the underglow kit, which I will have that eventually. I don't know when, but eventually I'll have that. And I did talk to Custom Dynamics. If you are like me, you have the headlight, you have the Bluetooth controller, you can call Custom Dynamics and they will build the custom order. Basically what you'll do is get the underglow kit minus the Bluetooth controller because you already have it. Just some food for thought. So, after I have everything wired in, you're looking for a spot to put it. Uh, some people probably put it right here. I didn't like it because you couldn't, you know, it would vibrate and all that. So what I do is stick mine right down in this little gap here and pull the wires over to the side. That way when the seat gets down on it, it's not breaking the wire connections through here. My Pro Glow is right here, or not my Pro Glow, Triple Play is right here. I just have it stuck right there. All the other wires, you know, push down, make sure nothing's gonna pinch or get in a bind, and you just put your seat back on, and you're done, enjoying your product. The uh, switch I actually have located in the frame deflectors over here. That way it's hidden out of the way. Uh, I really like this setup. 
the one thing I would give custom dynamics advice on would be to not send just a bare wire with no end. Actually put a plug on it and change your triple play to another line where you can just plug it into the triple play. And then you don't have all these other harnesses that you're having to tap into. And Because uh, as you can see, I have several harnesses here. And the, the, I, it is what it is. I'm stuck with a bunch of harnesses. Not going to sweat it. Can't really see it. And the only people who really see it is everybody watching this video and my mechanics. So. But that's a simple installation. It's not hard. Anybody can do it. Um, I do not have my latch lights hooked up yet. There is a specific reason why, and that reason will be coming out here soon, hopefully. Maybe next week. Maybe next month. I don't know yet. Uh, a lot of moving parts going on, but uh, once those moving parts all connect and start working as a unit, then uh, everybody will find out what I'm talking about. But until then, I hope you enjoyed this video. Real super simple. Uh, if you don't mind, share it, give me a like, comment. Please, please comment on it. If you have any questions, comment. Uh, and, and subscribe and hit the, the bell notification. Uh, help me get in the algorithm, because Lord knows I need the help. <laughs> but anyways, until the next one, I'll see you later.